Hello everyone, my name is Chella Doodle, and today we will be discussing updates that I want to see for Animal Crossing New Horizons. Before we get started, I just want to let you guys know that I do not think all these updates will happen, but I think some of them could, but if they do not, I will not be that disappointed, as the Animal Crossing team has been doing an amazing job, and has been really creative, and has really listened to the community over the past year. So, whatever things they do add will probably be amazing. With that said, let's get started. I think it would be so cool for the for Animal Crossing to add mini games in some shape or form, whether it be a little mini console of types going somewhere else, or adding more items that allow you to build your own mini games, kind of like the Mario set. I think this would make the game even more fun to play multiplayer. They could even make it so you could play against a villager if you not not have a Nintendo Switch Online account. In other versions of Animal Crossing, like the earlier games, as well as Pocket Camp, you can ask villagers if they want you to do anything for them, which I think would be so fun in New Horizons and make players have a reason to come back to the game. I personally would love this because it would give me more reasons to talk to my villagers every day because as of right now, I do not have too many reasons to. The current system where they only ask things once in a while is cool because they are fun quests, but they feel pretty rare. I have over 500 hours on my Switch and have only done the scavenger hunt twice. I think adding more as well as making them more common would be a ton of fun. It'd be nice if you could also speak to them if they wanted to play a game and then they could say yes or no. This would be so much fun in my opinion and would definitely add hours of playing time to this game. In the GameCube version, there was a ball that you could kick around the island. I think it'd be so cool to make a new item type that you could choose to place on your island and play with. This would make some fun mini games to do with friends like soccer, which would be so much fun. They could also make it optional to place it down so it would not ruin people's aesthetics or look out of place. Plus, then you could probably pick the color and try to get all the colors, which is always so much fun. I really think that adding Tortimer's Island back is a must. With how much everyone binged the game at release, it's kind of hurt the longevity of this game, and adding something like Tortoise Mars Island with new items, fruits, and especially multiplayer mini games, I think would bring the game back for so many people. I think it would be so cool and exciting to have a new type of item to collect. The gyros from previous games look so cute, and I think people would get super creative with them. I also love that they sing, and I'm always happy to have another noisy item on my island to interact with. Of course, this also brings up Brewster. I think it'd be fun to have him in a little coffee shop on the island, but I'm not going to talk about him too much because even though I think it'd be so amazing to have another shop, everyone and their doodle is talking about Brewster right now. It is almost a little excessive. I would really like to see another Nook's Cranny upgrade with more items. I think it'd be so cool to have an upstairs or even a rare items area where they sell colors that are hard to get, or an area where your villagers could sell an item that they have in their house without getting rid of it. Because personally, I love some of the furniture in my villagers' houses, but have struggled to obtain it myself. There are so many possibilities with this, and many of the previous games expanded Nook's Cranny quite a bit, so I want to see what New Horizon does somewhat similar. I think doing the Sanrio sets for Animal Crossing was a smart move by Nintendo, even with the whole mess of buying them. I think Nintendo could do some more sets, and it would be really cool to have new brand new villagers and items correlating with them. This, in my opinion, is better than an upfront paid DLC because other players can use the items if you trade them and can scan the cards into their games. Personally, I have loaned my Sanrio Amiibo cards to a few of my friends and we're all able to get the items, which works out great for everyone. So if they continue to do more types of Amiibo cards, I think this would actually work out amazing. New Horizons developers are clearly very creative and are doing an amazing job with the game. But everything they've done so far is to kind of catch up New Horizons with the other games with holidays, items, NPCs, and I want to see them do something completely different to really set New Horizons apart from the other games. I think it'd be so cool if New Horizons got its own never-before-seen NPCs. The New Horizon developers have proved to be very creative, and I am excited to see what they do since New Horizons is mostly caught up to the other Animal Crossing games now. I think this would be such a cute holiday to have because it would be more individual to each island. I do not think this update will happen anytime soon, if at all, especially since we just passed the first anniversary of Animal Crossing, but I think it'd be so cool to have a day where you celebrate the day you started your island. I'm not sure if this could work or not, but have old villagers come back, 
back to celebrate with you and even have your starters come and have Tom Nook talk about the founding of your island with you and your starters standing in front of everyone. There are a ton of other things you could do with this too, like sell items with your flag on them, as well as have other games and have your existing villagers talk about the island in general. I think this could be so cute and add to add and make your island feel special and different from everyone else's for one holiday. Unlike the last idea I had, I think this one could actually really happen because the community has been wanting to place rugs outside, and Nintendo does listen when a ton of people start asking for certain features, like the extra storage and the more custom designs. This would be so cool, and for many different islands, this will really open up a ton of options. One character that I have heard people want to return is Katrina. In previous games, she was associated with the Lux system, which New Horizons lacks. If she does make a return, I think she will be doing something else like maybe a small holiday like Rover, Reese, and Cyrus. I do not know if she will be added in, but since her face is in the Animal Crossing Online app, it could be a possibility. I think something cool that they could potentially add is allowing us to decorate our villagers' houses. A way they could do this is have a villager at a certain friend level ask for you to help them redecorate, and you can maybe use the items you have as well as some of the current items that they already have to help them build a new interior for their house. I would personally love to help decorate my villagers' houses and give my starters a personalized home. It would also be very useful because if you've accidentally ruined a villager's house because you just randomly gifted them stuff, you can kind of fix your mistake. I have heard from so many people that they want Gracie Grace back. I think it'd be fun to have a sassy character come to our island and sell some high-end items. Since all the characters are super sweet in this game, it'd be great to have one that is still nice but a bit sassy towards the player. Her set is also pretty cool and it'd be amazing to see what the developers would do to update it. With all games where you can talk to characters as often as you want, it would be super nice to have some more dialogue. I feel like this could help revive the game for people who have played it for over a year now, since for a while, the only people that some of us talked to were our villagers. I think it'd be so cool if they added some species-specific dialogue. That'd be so much fun and really spice up the day-to-day -day conversations with our villagers. I do not expect this, but I would love if each character could have a, their own little bit of dialogue. But I know that would be a ton of work, but again, it is fun to think what each villager would say outside of their personalities always say. The mail system in New Horizons gets the job done, but I think they could expand it and really make it more interactive. I think it would be so cool if villagers could request items through the mail or NPCs would mail you saying that they're stopping by or thanking you for your business or even advertising their products. I am not sure if this could work or not, but I would love to see if your old villagers that have moved out would mail you. Even if it was a generic update about what they're doing, that would be so fun and make it feel like... They just don't now live in a pit somewhere and actually have a light horizon to check out the rest of my channel. If you like any of these updates or think of something that I did not, drop it in the comments as I love engaging with you guys on topics like this. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye!